While I'm baking these cookies, I wanted to touch on this new year. Whether you've had an amazing start or not so very good start, just know that these ups and downs are inevitable and there will be good and bad days and that's a given part of life for us to grow and excel. But to sprinkle some hope into your life, you guys absolutely got this. Have faith, believe in yourself, and know that anything is possible if you put your mind to it and trust in the Most High. and chewy. I love the um, texture of the arts and that chewy flower. So good. <laughs> this tear is so So as this new year has begun, I have been doing a lot of inner reflection. I have a revelation that I want to share with you guys who may be struggling with the same thing. Something that I've always told myself was to be myself and throughout my young adult life, it's something I've always struggled with to just be me and as simple as it sounds, it's really hard to do so when you have a lot of insecurities and you just don't know how to be in your own skin. But there has been progress and discovery of myself through growing in my faith and knowing God, solely finding my identity in Christ alone, which is a big game changer when you finally 
you are at that stage. It's come a long way. But through my revelation, I realized that through the storm is where the growth comes. I wanted to be so perfect and have my whole life all sorted, not realizing that life is going to be a never ending journey of hardships and suffering. But we suffer well and stay strong through God. Through these many years, I've only realized now how important it is to truly, truly be yourself. And nothing hits better when you're in a storm. What I mean is that if I've had this revelation or was told these things like a year ago, it wouldn't have hit the same way and soaked in the same way. Like I would have understood it and agreed with it, but it just wouldn't register the same way. That's what makes it so special that when you're going through a storm, the crazy amount of growth and learning that you get from it, including my revelation, not following the true moral nudges of your heart and not truly being who you are can be a huge disservice to yourself and to your purpose. Another thing I wanted to mention is that you can't fit into a mold that isn't meant for you. And realizing that now, I feel like I've gained more confidence in myself that way. And the best thing that we can do is just be ourselves without any hidden agendas. A lot with like teens and even just young adults, or maybe even adults in general, that trying to be someone else's life and envying them is just wasting away at our own life's purpose and truth. So that was a little revelation that I had before my birthday. It's a heavy topic for me because I have struggled with this endlessly throughout my life journey. I'm still learning. I'm nowhere near where I would like to be, but I'm getting there. I hope you guys have a wonderful day today. Hopefully you guys could relate to me in some way and I hope everyone has an amazing, amazing year ahead of them, even through the storms. These things will only make us become stronger and a better version of ourselves. heading to Bonga now. It's a Korean barbecue. So we're having that for my birthday with my family. I'm super excited. I'm really hungry. Because, well, it might be out. See if, see if it bumps up. Cheers.
I know what you been through, been through. I know what you like. I know